Temple students, my name is Rebecca Bender. And I am Teddy Lee. This is the Hoot News, Temple Japan's newsroom where we inform you about events and happenings around campus. Getting a job in Japan can be hard. Check out the career fair on March 14th from 3.30 to 6 o'clock. If you want to come extra prepared, attend one of the on-campus career fair prep seminars taking place March 6th, 12.40 to 13.30 or March 7th, 16.45 to 17.30 in Azabu 2.12. Midterms can be stressful, so I'm sure you could use a little comedy and some fun. Uh, being one of the biggest cities in the world, Tokyo has many places to go see some comedy and get a good laugh. Uh, one of these places is the Good Heavens Comedy Club. They offer weekly open mic nights and comedy from their on-staff comedians. Uh, check it out for some fun this weekend. Now that we all know when we can apply for classes, the wheels must be turning to try and figure out what classes to take. An interesting and new course has been added to the communications department, but it's open to all students as well. Sociology 8238 is a class about sports and leisure in American society. This class will take place Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, 12 o'clock to 13.30 this summer. This class is definitely a home run. <laughs> this weekend has a few more events around Tokyo. Uh, last week we mentioned the firewalking festival near Takao-san, but there's also the Japanese local food matsuri happening in Yoyogi Park near the NHK Broadcasting Center from 10 to 1600. Uh, vendors from Hokkaido to Kyushu will be at this event, so head out and enjoy what foods Japan has to offer, and you can even head up to Harajuku afterwards. Being a student in Japan can be expensive, so for this week's Freshman 5, we're going to cover some of the ways that you can get discounts throughout Tokyo. Number one. If you haven't gotten a student SWICA pass yet, you probably should get on that about now. Uh, it'll save you a lot of money on transportation. Talk to facilities office about how to get a student SWICA. But it doesn't stop there. You can actually get discounts on train tickets, like the one to Narita Airport, with your student ID. Number two, many local cinemas offer student discounts, and so do comedy clubs. The Good Heavens Club we mentioned earlier has a student discount. Don't be afraid to ask establishment if they have student offers. Number three, are beautiful city views more your style? The Rapungi Hills Tokyo City View gives a student discount so you can enjoy the lights of downtown at a more affordable price. Check out their website for more details. Feeling a little homesick? I know I, I definitely have felt a little mm -hmm. homesick. Japan Airlines has teamed up with Student Universe to give a student discount to study abroad students on their flights. This might be a good option for visiting home between the semesters. Number five. Last but definitely not least, try to get an International Student Identification Card, ISIC. If you get this, you'll be open to a large amount of discounts throughout Japan. Check out their website for more details. And that's all for this week's Freshman 5. If you have any suggestions for topics you'd like us to cover in the following weeks, go ahead and message us at templenewsjp at gmail.com or contact us on our Facebook at The Hoot News. For student written articles and events around campus, or, if you have ideas for future segments, find us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, or check out our previous broadcasts on our YouTube page. We hope you have a wonderful week, and we look forward to providing you with campus updates throughout the school year. The, the TUJ, TUJ Newsroom, where, where we give a hoot about you. About you.